and welcome back to YT France, your favorite news station for all news about France. Let's just play the statement from the Prime Minister, <coughs> Herr Hitler. As the duly elected Prime Minister of France, I must say that the French people are more willing than willing to surrender to you. But dog, you have to shave off that mustache first. It just looks gay. Okay, that's enough for the humorous bit. Uh, welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4 as France. Let's just get this bad boy rolling. We did lose a few days. Uh, when I turned off the recording, somehow or another, I accidentally turned off the pause, or I never did click properly on the pause. So when, by the time I noticed it, we had lost a few days. It's no big deal. So, so I let it go. Because I did not have a save to go back to that would have just eliminated whatever, how many days it was. Two to five days. It wasn't that long. And the general plan on the focus tree, I was looking over. After we get our first extra research slot, which we can start on after we finish these military factories, we're going to go after a strengthened government and defense stratagem, because defense stratagem will remove disjointed government. And we definitely need that. <laughs> I would have rather waited. Because you have to realize, disjointed government also eliminates point eighty, point eight, eight tenths of a power point every day. So we do need to get rid of that. What the hell are you doing? And the Hindenburg blew up. What the hell is he doing? He's coming to France? Uh, no, he's leaving. What the hell was that? You, you just came to go to a whorehouse? What up with that? Is he going back again? Yep. Yep. He's in a loop. Mm -hmm. The AI is confused. Soviet withdrawal. On the Japanese border. Hopefully this will bring a lasting peace. Come on now. Stalin is working on his constitution. Oops, wrong one. No, I didn't want to do that. I just wanted to see what Britain was. I'm having problems, okay? There we go. Fortify the Rock. Gibraltar. Germany is Army Innovations. Poland is... Develop Upper Silesia, Czechoslovakia, Military Technical Institute. What about Italy? Capital ship effort. And that's why I'm building up my navy. <clears throat> I would be happy to just be able military factories. I would be happy to just yeah, be able won't. to defeat the Italian Navy. Engineer Company. Whoop, whoop. That makes me happy. Seriously tempted to go after Field Hospital now. It is 37 still. Could go after a 36 battleship though. Won't be adding any more carriers because we don't have the ability. We don't have the uh, infrastructure, the the military factories to concentrate on building still yet more aircraft. Yeah, we're going to have to go after... We're going to 
Where'd he go? Oh, there it is. Field hospitals. I am putting forth extra effort at building up our support equipment. So if we can knock these out early, which just adds to the need to have a general. Uh, gen what the hell are they called? Oh, a theorist. Yes, the Gaul. Although, right now, I'd, I'd accept him just to get the 500s of army experience daily. How's our recruitment going? Not enough manpower or equipment to train the division. Okay, let's back this down. See what happens now. 100% supplied, 89% supplied. We need 37,000 infantry equipment just to upgrade reinforcements. We need our 17,000 infantry equipment. Okay. How's our production looking? Uh, we're only at 33% capacity. Well, the efficiency cap is 70%, so we're not even halfway up the efficiency path. Producing 41 a day. adding to tanks and once we get those new fighters coming in we'll at least put at least three factories on that at least about construction it's time to start thinking about adding over here four more military factories Amelia Earhart disappears. So far, we're not hitting the historical. It's been pretty historical. Just wasting some effort on infrastructure because that's where we're going to be packing divisions in. I want to make sure that they are properly supplied. Yes, you would be Paris. Paris. He's actually semi confident on the German front. It's the Italian Écoutez. front. The Italian front lacks any confidence. Low manpower, we're down. 241,000 available. How's our trade situation looking? The oil would be nice if we could get some somewhere. will not be able to increase our conscription Marco Polo bridge incident we won't be able to increase our conscription until we're at war I'm creating my own 
short ball of equipment. I like the 100 number. I believe the German formations ran on paper closer to 200. I mean 150. If I remember correctly, that was... I'm not even going to say what the Jesh will water. And we have it. Let's split that into two. We got our extra research slot. Let's get out of the black and white stuff. Uh, let's do our focus first. We know where we're going. Strengthen the government. Okay, here, we'll go ahead and go construction. Construction will come in handy. Attention. Attention. Paris. Go down to the Italian front. We have to come up with divisions for the Spanish front, too. As I said before, one time when I played France, I ended up with all three of the fascist countries coming at me at once. It was a nightmare. I do believe I lost that one. So the longer, <clears throat> excuse me, the longer the Spanish Civil War goes on, the happier I will be. And I'm really not, don't care who wins, because it's possible that we could end up in a situation where we will end up at war with the Soviet Union. And if Spain becomes communist or fascist, since I am and now in bed with Great Britain, I can end up at war with either one. I can view them as an enemy on my borders no matter what. This just doesn't make any sense. The AI concentrated Bozard. two armored divisions in the same place even though infantry is a hell of a lot better at defense. Just doesn't make any damn sense. Is that fortified? Yes, it is. This is where fortifications stop. I have not started construction up towards the coast or down the Italian coast yet. Here. Extend the Maginot Line, Alpine Forts. There we go. Also, 10% bonus. As for which direction we will go after we get rid of disjointed government, I'm not really sure. We could use, definitely use more military factories and civilian factories. The fact that it will be in the colonies will give us a little bit of breathing space. We could also use this extra research slot. But, we definitely need to fortify our borders. France's biggest advantage is defense. And that's going to be my basic strategy dealing with the Nazis. I'm going to fortify the hell out of my borders. And put as many infantry divisions as I can on them. Three military factories. Damn. Put as many military fa... Damn it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Put as many infantry divisions as I can on the fortified borders. And then you wait. You let them bang... Beat themselves into submission. Then when you got a green check mark, then you attack. 
it's that simple it's not pretty it's ugly as all hell but as France you have no other choice that is the best way I have seen to win as France now you can tear me a new a-ho you can tell me well you did this you did that and yes all of that can work but so many times I tried to go on the offensive against Germany and I only shot myself in the foot by doing so the problem is to defend the entire border and not lose control of the situation and Japan goes to war against China it is September 1937 we are already at 10% world tension what's Germany doing naval rearmament Interesting. They have not gone. Attention. Aux ordres. Aux ordres. I am going to send those guys over to there. Attention. And replace it with one of them. One infantry. So it's not very fair trade for them. But I don't care. He lost two armored divisions and he got one infantry. They may have only been armor brigades. But either way. I don't like the way they were stacking them. Attention! Missing equipment in production. Oh. That's from all of the expansion of our air forces that I did we need fighter naval bombers and tactical bombers well I can plan those out perfect uh, strength in government Chinese United Front forms we got concentrated industry too Uh, I'm not that well organized. It's not 38. Let's go after that battleship. Oh. Wait a minute. We need to get our focus. We can only stack 10 days of focus. What? Wait, 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 wait. What's this? Strengthen government support idea has run its course. Oh, hell. We need 365 days of that. Never mind. Let's go after... Those civilian and military factories. Now, what are we going to get? We're working on our battleship. No, I'm not going to worry about strategic bombers. At least not yet. Maybe radio. Radio would be nice. Excavation, reforce, resource gain efficiency. Too far ahead of schedule to mess with that. Logistics, tempting. Radio would en let us enable signal company, which will give us a bonus to initiative. Which would be one more plus while on the defensive. Armor. No, we're too far ahead of schedule to push. Anti-tank. Once again, tempting. If I had some bonuses, I might go after the next land doctrine. Go after a naval doctrine, maybe? We don't suffer no penalties on naval doctrines. Let's just go after... Where is it at? A radio. Improve our reinforce rate.
getting closer on field hospital. Yeah, they belong. And what he said. What did he say? I don't have a clue. All right. Attention. AI is telling us they don't like. Was all the German or the Italian fronts? I mean, look, they put 33 divisions on our border, and we've got 10. We're outnumbered three to one, depending on how their divisions are equipped, of course. We're down to 223,000 available manpower. Recruitable population goes up 1,000 a month. Our deficit on infantry equipment is still 12,000. Okay, we were going to expand naval bomber and tactical bomber. We got field hospital now. There's naval bomber. And there's our tactical bomber. Put three to start and two. We will add to that later. Short oil again. Uh, let's just grab it from the US. We should have no problems getting raw materials from the US. Is 37, almost 38. Don't want to jump ahead and grab something that far in advance. Synthetic oil, I think they said they changed it to where until you get to the third level, you don't get rubber. First two levels, you only get oil now. Or maybe that's one of the mods I was reading about. I guess we'll just go after computing machine I don't want to try jumping ahead when I only have four fresh four research slots we started with only three I don't want to jump ahead just yet Besides that, I'd rather get some focus tree bonuses. Speaking of which, Algeria is about done. I need to worry about setting up these guys with orders. More civilian factories. Do it. Civilian factories up close. And build the military factories in our heartland.
And okay, yeah, you can visit. Just uh, leave your pounds. Yeah, be sure to st don't forget to take. They're doing back and forth again. Oh no no, he's actually no, he's going back. That's crazy. Makes you wonder what the hell the AI is doing. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm sorry. Ah. Definitely concentrating on the military factories. What is our situation now? We have 22 military factories. We need a lot more. I need to get off my ass because Germany has how many military factories? 39 to 47. Yeah, I need to get off my ass. Uh, I said it, and I meant it. Civilian factories, just for shits and giggles. That'll keep them busy for a while. Normally, I build the hell out of civilian factories, but we're already in 1938. 16% world tension. Hitler should be going after... Nope, he's still concentrating on his navy. Maybe those French subs off his coast is in, are influencing him. Speaking of which, let's take a look at our navy production. That's a battle cruiser? Huh, I thought it was a battleship we were building. Building light cruisers and no more subs. The Dunkirk class. Battle cruisers. That means we're ahead of schedule on battle cruisers. Yeah, we are. Surface detection, surface visibility. How does this compare to this one? It's interesting, that's what it is. Okay. And it is thirty eight now. are all 39 but we can improve all of our equipment attention sending them south And now we have no troops training. Polish-Romanian alliance. Wow, that's going to be weird. Well, we're not going to be dragged into war by Czechos uh, by Poland if they formed an alliance. But we are out of time. Make sure the pause button is hit. Hey, I want to thank all of you. Definitely appreciate each and every one of you. And as I always do, I don't beg for likes, I don't beg for subscriptions, I beg for comments. Because I like your feedback. Give me your ideas, your observations, and of course, your orders. 
until I see y'all again next time. Bye-bye.